well, that comes with our current society's culture of canceling you, blocking you, unfriending you, where you virtually have no reach with this person. So my advice for this is that though this person has canceled you, this person cannot cancel your prayers. This person cannot cancel how you treat them. So as any chance that God gives you, practice doing good to them, reaching out to them, and the most of all, pray for them. Because prayer goes through barriers. Prayer goes through even if the person has blocked you or unfriended you or you know, um, up, uh, ignored you or even if they just go uh, and not want to, anything to do with you, your prayers, when answered by God for your enemies or those who are difficult to love or those who have canceled you, that can really do much in working on the heart of the person. So even if the person has canceled you, you still have that supernatural love from God to pray for them, that they can be open, that they can have that chance to reconcile, to ask for forgiveness for the reason why they canceled you in the first place. So if you offended them, this is the opportune chance to ask God, Lord, is there anything in me that I did wrong so that this person would avoid me or cancel me? And then you pray for the Lord to change you from the inside out and you pray for this person also. Prayer is really the greater work. It can make enemies into friends, make enemies into lovers, and that's all the work of God. For more videos and resources, visit the CCF Main YouTube channel.